Flowers have always been really important to me and I've loved them since as long as I can remember. So as a child, they were something that I was absolutely captivated with. So yeah, I just love them. I really could not imagine my life without flowers. I think a life without flowers would be a much sadder life. And at the age of 23, I moved to London and that's where I first went into the floral industry. Initially, I was just doing flowers for wedding and events, and then I, I slowly started to work in the fashion world, and through those contacts and what I do now, I do a lot of styling, I consult, I teach all over the world. I think I have a very simple philosophy when it comes to flowers. I love to show off flowers in their purest and most beautiful form. And as I've grown in the industry, my design has become a lot less compact, a lot more flowing, a lot more natural, a lot looser, and more lyrical, I suppose. And that, I think, shows off flowers to perfection. The abilities that I think are most important for somebody who wants to work in the floral industry um, are these three things. It's key that somebody has a good design eye. They need a design to be able to really connect with color and texture. The second thing is they need to be practical as well as artistic. They need to be able to work on construction and I think on a level to have common sense and to know how to approach things. And the third thing um, is to be willing to make mistakes. I think to be creative you need to be willing to make mistakes and there's almost a, a fearless sense that one needs to have and it's important to follow one's heart and I think there's a fine balance between that. Um, it's a creative tension between not being too crazy and not being too controlled. And it kind of is somewhere in the middle. And so it's those three things that I think are really key. I think in order to increase one's abilities, I think staying inspired is really important. To try and be creative every day is a wonderful thing. Uh, sometimes that's quite difficult, but I find that even just drawing a sketch once a day is a wonderful thing. It can just be a quick sketch, it can be a charcoal sketch. Doing things that you like, doing things that you love, going to see an art exhibition, just going to see a single painting in a museum, being out of doors, being in nature, that's something huge for me, whatever the season. Winter, summer, spring, autumn, there's so much happening around, there's so much to be inspired by. And you know, just a single spring flower, a snowdrop growing out of the snow, is incredibly inspiring to see something so beautiful growing out of something freezing cold. There's, there's so much, and I think if one embraces that whole side of creativity, uh, that really helps one's ability to work well and I think if one is inspired then one does a good job and a sense of gratitude really I mean working with flowers I'm very grateful that I work in this industry I'm very grateful for the clients that I work with I'm very grateful to be surrounded by nature and beautiful flowers and that it's it is my absolute joy to be able to create something absolutely exquisite with such natural beauty